Hi Sparkles! Before we start this video, make sure to check out my merch and accessories on my shop on www.cocosparkle.shop. There are a lot of amazing designs just waiting for you. Make sure to follow me on Instagram and on Roblox to show your amazing love. The link will be in the description down below. Be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already and turn on your notification bell so you can enjoy my weekly content. Love you Sparkles! I'm just so tired of you! All you ever do is hang around with your dumb friends and you don't know anything about your family! How dare you say that to me, you stupid moron! That's enough, Jake! I want this marriage to be over! I can't believe I managed to stay with you for years! And all you ever did is break my heart! And now you've even cheated on me?! Who wants to be with you anyway? You're still as pathetic as you were before. You are nothing, Jasmine. Don't forget that. Well, if you're so sure, then why don't you just leave my place immediately? Goodbye then. Now don't you dare ever come back here or I'll call the cops on you! <sighs> Welcome back. How was your day at school? Mom? Did Daddy leave us? <sighs> Mom, tell me! Where did Dad go? He... He's never coming back. No! Mom! Don't say that! I, I can't live without Dad! Honey, wait! Honey, please don't cry. Just leave me alone, Mom. I, I don't want to talk to anyone right now. Okay, honey. I'll leave. It's okay if you don't want to live with me anymore. I totally understand. Please come back. Miss Jolie, made a call for you. For me? Hello? Uh, hello, Julie. It's me, Jasmine speaking. Oh, hello, sis. How are you doing? <laughs> Not so well. Wait, why? Is everything okay? I wish, but no. I just ended my marriage with Jake. I can't live with him anymore. And now, Evelyn is so upset about everything. She doesn't even want me around. Hey, Julie. I've never asked you for anything, but now... Can you do something for me? Of course, sis. I'll do anything for you. Just tell me. I want you to take care of my baby. She needs love. Care. She needs to start a new life, and I don't want her to feel sad about not having a dad. She's still a kid, and she'll never think the same about me anymore. D do you think you can help my daughter? Where are you taking me? <sighs> Somewhere peaceful for you, honey. Don't worry, you'll be very happy there, I promise. So now you're leaving me as well? <sighs> it's... for your best. Oh my gosh! <laughs> You're here! 
I miss you so much. It's been so long. I know. Um... Oh, yeah, Evelyn. This is your aunt. Her name is Julie. Hi there, little one. <laughs> uh, hi. I've never seen you before. <laughs> That's right. Me and your mom are sisters. I just used to live far away from her. But I'm so happy that we finally met again. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll be going now. Wait! Mom! Why are you going all alone without me? <sighs> Mom! Mom, wait! Mom! <laughs> Mom! <laughs> you can't leave me! Mom! Don't worry, hun. You're not alone. Honey, she's your cousin. My cousin? Yeah, and she's going to live with us from now on. Wait, really? That means I can have sleepovers now? <laughs> sure, my baby. Oh, it's my boss. I'll see you guys. Um... My name's Harper, and you're... Uh, Evelyn, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's so good to see you. You know, I always wanted a sister the same age as me, and I'm so happy to have you here. Uh, really? You are? <laughs> of course. Do you like to watch scary movies? Oh, yeah. I loved watching The Possessed Doll by Coco Sparkle. Oh, that's my favorite! Do you want to watch The Origin of the Doll by Coco Sparkle with me? Sure! And that's how we became best friends. We'd always play and have fun together. We even went to the same school, and every time I got into trouble, she helped me and I did too. Until we were in ninth grade, everything changed. Never change. Okay, okay, I'm done. Let's go. <laughs> Look at your hair. What's up with my hair? It's way better than yours. <laughs> sure, sure. Here, let me help you. You know, sometimes I wonder why you're my best friend. Huh? You had to be my mother. <laughs> oh, stop it. Here's your assignment. Let's go. We only have two minutes. Oh, okay. Let's go.
Bye, girls. Ah, uh, thank you so much for helping me, girl. I got an A. <laughs> you deserve it. Hey, look, that's the new guy. Yeah, I heard that he has a very bad reputation. Huh? Oh, really? Excuse me? How dare you talk like that about me? Do you have a death wish? Stop! Uh, Don't you dare say anything to her! <gasps> you... You'll have to pay for this! I'll make sure of it! Was that enough? Or do you still need me to punch on your face more? Pathetic. Let's go, Harper. What a stupid little jerk. <sighs> you shouldn't have punched him like that. I ain't scared of him. I don't care what he does now. All I care about is you, Harper. You're my best friend, and it was my responsibility to stand up like that for you. I guess. Hey, girl. <laughs> you want me to kick you, huh? What? What are you talking about? <laughs> There's a note on your back. It says to kick you. <laughs> We didn't mean to. It's just the new guy made us do that. Huh? Who? His name is Alexander. That little jerk! Hey! <laughs> What do you want from me? Well, I was the one who told those guys to do that. Huh? What is this little jerk doing with Harper? You did what? <laughs> That's what you get for messing up with me. That's enough, Alexander! You did this, didn't you? Oh, ho, ho, ho. did you see me do it? Oh, wait, you didn't. And it's best that you don't come to me with false accusations like that. You know, I'm a very dangerous man. Oh, dangerous you say, huh? Seems like you forgot that punch already. You better remember that and stay away from my friend or I'll... Or else what? Huh? Don't worry, girl. I won't do anything to her because you're my new target now. You! Please stop! I don't want anyone to fight! P please, Eve, let's go! But Harper! Please. <sighs> Fine. Oh wait! Where are you guys heading off to now, huh? Where's all that attitude? <laughs> Ugh! You should've let me punch him in the face! No, Evelyn, he's not like some normal guy. His dad is the richest. What if he... Oh, Harper, he's just a little loser who's insecure about himself. He always messes with you. I can't just let him go like that. He's a jerk who needs to learn his lesson. But you're not a jerk. You're better than this. Just let it go. I made a mess out of him and he pulled a prank. It's not a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> I hope
hope you loved that! <laughs> Woohoo! Toodles! Huh? I'm so gonna kill him this time! No, wait, Evelyn! I have to go now, Harper! We can't just let the jerk do this to us! He's crazy, but you're not! If you want to teach him a lesson, you should use your brain, not your hands! I guess… <laughs> oh, Harper! I'm so sorry about yesterday. You see, you're so pretty and I didn't want to hurt you like that. But that stupid girl, Eve, she made me do it out of anger. Can you forgive me? I really want to make it up to you. Would you go out and watch a movie with me later tonight? What the freak? Hey, you! You ugly and stupid guy! I think I told you to stay away from my friend! What are you doing being all nice and flirty with her, huh? Come on, Eve. He was just apologizing to me for what he did. Are you kidding me, Harper? Do you think a jerk like him can ever change? Come on, why don't you ever be nice to someone? You know what? I'm going out with him for a movie night, and you need to accept that. What? You can't… Ugh. Who am I even kidding? Do what you want, but so you know, he's a big jerk! I've warned you! Alexandra, you're so sweet. I always feel so secure hanging out with you. Yeah, I always enjoy spending time with you too, cutie. What the fish? Ew! Guys, we have an announcement to make. Harper and I are officially dating. <laughs> what? What? No, that can't be true. Harper would never. Oh, Eve, it's true. It took me some time to realize that Alexander is a really nice guy. He's super rich and he's super smart. And most importantly, he loves me very much. Now that I know him, I'm never leaving him. Oh. <laughs> I love you, babe. I love you, too. <laughs> but, but, what about us? Oh, come on. There's no us now. And don't act like we broke up or something. I can always find friends, but I can never find a true lover like Alexander in my life. He's not a true lover, Harper. He's just a stupid jerk who's trying to play games. And once he's done, he's going to leave you for sure. <sighs> You're always so full of yourself, Eve. I really love Harper, and I can smell the burn. You're just jealous of my beautiful girlfriend and me. Jealous of you? Ew! I don't have enough freaking time for this madness! I'm out of here! Thank you so much for your friendship, Harper! Hey there! Ah! You idiot! You almost scared the freak out of me! <laughs> Were you looking for me? 
I know I'm irresistible, and the way you looked at me that day... Well, I know it's not your fault, I'm just so, uh... Stupid! You're just a stupid jerk! Now let go of me! How dare you get any closer to me! I swear I'm gonna kill you! Whoa! Easy there, sugar. The fun has just begun. Remember? I told you I was coming for you. Well, here I am. Your friendship, your silly attitude, and your stupid arrogance. I'm gonna destroy them one by one. And you'll be able to do nothing. Nothing at all! You're just going to cry and cry over and over and over again! Well, in that case, I'll tell the principal about everything you do! You're in a relationship with my friend, and yet you're trying to flirt with me?! <laughs> do what you want to do, baby girl. I'll probably see how you manage to go up to the principal. See ya! Uh, that's enough! I need to tell the principal right now! Huh? What? what Evelyn the boyfriend stealer? What? And there's a picture of me? Who did this? Oh my gosh, that filthy rat! Hello? <laughs> <laughs> did you like the surprise? How was it? Cool, right? Why are you doing this? <laughs> If you don't do as I say, I'm gonna make these pics go viral and imagine what's gonna happen to you and your reputation next. You, you can't do this! Oh yeah, I can. Bye bye now. Alex! Alex! Oh no! What am I going to do now? Look at them, so happy. <clears throat> Sorry to bother your lovey-dovey moment, guys, but hey, Harper, I'll just call you in her room right now. Oh, okay. I'll be back in a bit, babe. Sure, I'll wait for you, baby. Up to now. Ooh, wait up. What do you want from me now? You know, I'd really love for you to come over to my house tomorrow for my birthday party and serve some drinks there. It'll be an honor for someone like you to even be there. This jerk. So, what do you say? Oh, really? Thanks for the invitation. I'll make sure to be there at the right time. Yeah, that's my girl. That's how I want you to be in front of me, following my orders. Now get out of here. Oh, sure. Anything you say. Goodbye, Alex. They say it right. He's so dang rich, but still very pathetic. Ugh. Hey! Happy birthday, Alexander! Oh, thanks, but you came empty-handed? Where's my gift? Oh, your gift? Right there! How dare you get any closer to me! I swear I'm gonna kill you! Whoa! Easy there, sugar. The fun has just begun. Remember? I told you I was coming for you. Well, here I am. Your friendship, your silly attitude, and your stupid arrogance. I'm gonna destroy them one by one. And you'll be able to do nothing. Nothing at all! 
You're just going to cry and cry over and over and over again. <gasps> oh my lord, that's so messed up! About everything you do! You're in a relationship with my friend, and yet you're trying to flirt with me? Stop it! Just stop it! <laughs> it's not me, I swear! I'll probably see how you managed. It's not me, I swear! Uh, Harper, this witch is crazy! She's trying to frame me, it's fake! She made that up! No, you idiot! I recorded that! Uh -huh. Why'd you do that? Are you out of your mind? The day I saw you getting close to her, I knew something was up, so I recorded it and showed it to the principal. But after you blackmailed her, we decided that you deserved a way grander audience, Alexander. We? What do you mean by that? Aw, looks like you're a real jerk, Alexander. Did you actually think Harper was on your side? Aw, you poor little thing. She's been my best friend for the last 12 years, and you really thought she'd give up on me for a stupid jerk like you? You're not the only one who knows how to act, Alexander. The day you almost burnt our ears with those horns, that was the day we planned to get back at you. And this ain't the only birthday gift for you. We have your cell phone right here, and it is all the text messages which show how badly you've bullied other students. You... how did you find that? Just the same way we got that video. Of course I helped her, you dummy. Remember, I asked you to throw this party, and why do you think I became your girlfriend in the first place? Ooh, sounds spicy. Feeling the burn now, Alexander? You, I'll kill you. That's enough. I can't believe you're my son. You have let me and my reputation down. I'm disowning you, and I'm sending you to a boarding school forever. No, Dad! Uh, please don't do that to me! Dad, no! Dad? I is that... M my d dad <laughs> We taught him a good lesson, didn't we? I told you to use your brain other than your hand. Uh... Evelyn? Are you okay? Th that's my d dad What? Who? Alexander's father? D does that mean you're his sister? I still remember his face I'm so sorry if he caused you any trouble, kids I... Huh? Eve? Oh my gosh, it's you, honey I missed you so much, Dad! Where have you been? Why did you leave us? Mommy left me too! <laughs> I was left all alone, Dad! I'm sorry, honey. I made a big mistake leaving you. I didn't want to leave you like that, honey. I, I had to. And I regret it now. Do, do you know where Mom is? Never. <laughs> 